You know, Churchill, our life has become somewhat um, involved with other people's hassle, so to say. Having to fix things for everybody, it's rather irritating, is it not? So, I need to get down some kind of issue that's affecting the water. I mean, I'm not surprised. Look at all this garbage. Oh, my God. So... Okay, that's what it is. It's a, it's a, yep, yeah, all right, that's what it is. That's what it is. Churchill. 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 Uh, Churchill. Well, I mean, hello? Okay, okay, it's got legs. Let's go. Oh, jeez, I missed. Oh god, I missed again. Okay. Run, Churchill! Watch out! This thing's psychotic! It's come to do us in. Okay. Okay, it's on my case now. Okay. Did I kill it? Did I kill it? Did I kill it? I don't even know. Okay, I didn't. Ow, 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 ow. Alright. Alright. Kill it. Ooh, Churchill! Puppy dog! I'm coming, mate! Alright. Are you okay? Stupid thing. Ugh, gross. Blech. Well, hey, that's one problem taken care of. Come on then, Churchill, let's um go and get the next one. So Is there more of them or something? Bloody glowing ones, for crying out loud, of all the things. So, hmm. Let's, let's, let's just, okay. Well, we kind of took care of one before the other, but never mind. Oh. Okay, so there's another issue this way. Okay. Jeez. Municipal plutonium well. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think that may be the problem. Is there anybody here? Hello? Cooking pot. Crumbling catwalk. Yeah. Oh, this is, this is, this is good news, isn't it? Bloody hell. Yep. Are you... Okay, Jesus! Right, all right, all right! Stupid thing! What the hell, man? But never-ending... Lever-action rifle? Ooh. Taking it. Unlimited ammo capacity. Well, why not? Why not, eh? Um... I'll take the meat. It's quite weighty, but that's fine. Um, okay. Oof. Do we... Can we do something about this? Are we supposed to shut it off? Or just... Oh. Water purifier. Hey. Hello? Do I... Um, hmm. Does it maybe need power or something? Uh, okay. Um, hmm. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm stuck in it. There we go. I'm fine. I'm fine. So. Oh, Churchill, have you found the route? Have you found the way, puppy? You may have, my dear. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, God, I'm stuck. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, okay, alright, 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 I'm just, yep. Excuse me, you. That is my puppy dog that you are assaulting there. I don't appreciate it, and neither does he. Thank you very much. You know what? Well... Um, 
Might as well take out its legs. Arms next. Head. There you go. Missed. Yep. Got it. Got it. Yep. Okay. Okay. Alright, Churchill. Here we go. Alright. Shh. There you go. Okay. You're alright. What? Okay. Mm -mm. So, can we now activate this? Or does it... Okay, there's somebody there. There's a person. Who are you? Sir? Excuse me. Oh, careful. Do you know what, Churchill? Let's... Do you know... I just... Um, yeah. I'm just going to reload this. And I'm going to pull out my shotgun. Reload that. And we'll just go back and we'll tell her the good news that we've... Resolve the problem, would you say? Hotel Rexford. Hey! Hotel. Ah, uh, doesn't look very inviting though, does it? Hello? Any chance of a room? No. Come on, puppy. Let's go. Well, that was fairly straightforward, I do fear. Alright. Um, sorry about that. Just put my uh, gun away. Madam, I have fixed the problem. Yes, the problem is no more. Please tell me you have good news. I do, Polly Esther. I have good news. Wait, really? Yes. Um, some ghouls were contaminating the water supply in Camden. Ghouls? Yes. How could they have got in? Well, I don't know. We upgraded the ghoul grip traps relatively recently. They must have made their way in around the same time the hooligans did. Mm. Captain Reasonable's been so distracted with the commuters. Let me just check the levels. Okay. My God, you actually did it. I can't tell you how thankful I am. Here, take this. It what? still doesn't solve the problem of the non-members, though. Um... I mean, is there anything that... Well, yeah, what actually happened to Mr. Gray's purifiers after he died? I'm not sure. Mr. Gray had a son, Jesse. He's locked himself away in their home and won't come out or speak to anyone. I've been meaning to go back again and check on the boy, but then everything went tits up around here. I haven't had a chance. Well, I mean, I could go and have a look if you want. Would you mind stopping by Mr. Gray's house and speaking to his son, Jesse? If he'll speak to you, maybe you could ask if he'd be willing to donate his father's purifier to the pistols. Um, I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Churchill... Come along, let's go. Jesse Gray. Hmm. Uh, what do you want to name Boaty. Oh, Hello, yeah. Boaty. Boaty. Oh, okay. Don't mind me, folks. Okay, so where is this dude's house? Let's have a look here. So. Catacombs, yes. Uh, yes. Petitions. All these bloody petitions, Churchill. Get the herbs. No, thank you. Speak to Jesse Gray. Well, do you know what, Churchill? Hmm. Get Captain Reasonable's endorsement. Ah, uh, to swing by Mornington Crescent or to swing by Camden Town Underground. Do you know what, Churchill? I think we will go to Mornington Crescent first of all and then go from there. Yes. Come on then. Let's go. Okay, so where does this guy live? Oh, there's a post box. I don't like post boxes. Is this. Oh! Okay. Alright. Thank you. Ooh ha ha! Stupid post boxes. Ah, horrible. Oh, is there somebody in here? Hello! Hey, motorbike. Ooh. Scalpel. Broken recorder. Whole heap of um, garbage, Churchill. Used oil can. We've still got to get the kid out, haven't we? Oh. Out of the, um, the fireplace. I don't quite know how we're going to do that, Churchill. It says to get oil, but does it mean cooking oil? Or does it mean... 
Does it mean machine oil? Just don't ask, don't ask. Can we go through? Oh. Well, ah, maybe this way. Can we slip through? Uh, in a word, no. Hmm. Hello? Nothing to say. They're not the most talkative folks on the planet, Churchill. But then, would you be? Is it here? Hmm. I assume the house will be quite an obvious looking thing. But then, who can say? Oh. <gasps> That's a big hole. Don't really fancy going down that. Hmm. So, can I climb up this? Okay. Yep. Traders welcome. Rustic homestead. Hello. Oh. Anarchy. Anarchy the dog. We found the dog. Anarchy. Hey now, calm down. Um. Nancy. Ah, there you are, Anarchy. Go home. Nancy's looking for you. Go on. There you go, we found Anarchy. Jesse, hello. Well, that is just rude. Um, yes, Polyester sent me here to speak to you. I don't care. Polyester can beat my ass. Well, I don't want to talk to anyone. Why are you out here all on your own? You're just a child. Good God. Uh, I'm sorry about your dad, you know. Thanks. He was great. And now it's my fault he's gone. How? I thought it'd be cool to have a pet fox. I'm such a moron. Um, it's not your fault. Yeah, I mean, you are just a kid and kids, you know, you don't always use your brain. You don't know anything. You weren't there. You don't know me and you didn't know my dad. Your dad didn't like the pistols? He liked them enough. Not enough to join up with them. Mm. He said they were too focused on themselves. That they couldn't see the bigger picture. He said we were better off on our own. That didn't really work out, did it? Um, did you agree with him? What? Yeah, I, I mean, I don't know. I go to school. My friend's parents are pistols. They're not bad people. There you go. My friends are all planning to try for sponsorship when they turn 18. Uh, the children of the pistols don't automatically have membership. Well, I suppose not. Because you have to kind of pledge yourself, don't you? Like I'm having to do. All because I want to go into the Houses of Bloody Parliament. No, they don't want any nepotism, whatever that means. The children of pistols benefit from the perks of their parents' membership until they turn 18. After that, they've got to find sponsors, just like everyone else. All right. And you wouldn't want to join the Pistols with your friends when you turn 18? No, I wouldn't. Sure, I've thought about it. It's not that I don't like the Pistols. I think I actually agree with a lot of what they say. My dad wouldn't have wanted me to join, though. Um, your dad would have wanted what's best for you, you know. I wish I could talk to him about it. Um, I think he'd say he'd want you to be happy. Yeah, of course he would. You're right. I guess I could keep an open mind and see what happens. Um, It would make a good impression if you let the pistols use your dad's water purifier. It would. Meh. So that's why you're here. What do the pistols want with it? Uh, they went, want to make sure that non-members have access to water as well. They do? Yep. My dad always said they only cared about their own. Well, he was wrong. Maybe 
he was wrong about some things. Yep. All right. Yeah. Let the pistols know the purifier is theirs. Well, all right. I mean, you shouldn't be out here on your own, kid, you know. I mean, it's fair play, I suppose, if you want to be out here. Just nick them bobby pins, mate. Call it a tax for coming out. For coming out here. I mean, why don't you just go and live in the in the where the pistols are? I think you'd be a lot safer, you know. And this is a little um, yeah, a little ramshackle. I wonder. No, I don't have the resources. Okay, well, uh, thanks, kid. We don't want the dog food. Definitely not. Knowing what's in it, Churchill. I don't think you'd want it either, mate. Well, all right. I suppose we'd better um, head on back then and let Miss Polyester know that um, you got yourselves another water purifier. Ooh, okay. More tickets. Can always appreciate tickets. Okay. <sighs> yeah, maybe she'll actually let us have a bit of a break. Good God, honestly. All we've done, Churchill, since day bloody day dot is um. Ooh. Is run around after everybody else. What is all this white streaks going past me? I don't like this. Is there a ghost in here? Hello. Oh, it's a cut through. Hey, well that's kind of cool. Hey, brilliant. Hmm. Lock penthouse. Ooh. Is it a penthouse that we can live in? Can I get into it somehow? Is there a way? A door? Ooh. It needs a key, though. Hmm. I'm guessing we have to get the key. Get the key. Tickets. Oh, rounds. Hey, come on now. All right, Churchill. Let's, um... Ooh. Let's go, shall we? Wend our way back and, um... Tell Polyester the brilliant news. Polyester, hello. Did he speak to Jesse? I did. I certainly did. Uh, he's agreed to let the pistols have access to his water filter. Excellent. I'll have my people head over there shortly. Hopefully the population in Camden stays stable. Otherwise we'll have to figure something else out, won't we? No matter. We'll cross that bridge when we cross it. Thank you for your help. I'll All stop right. throttling hydroponics. Take this. And let Paul Mira know she can stop banging on my door. Was there anything else? Um, I did have some questions about Jesse. Yes. What will happen to Jesse now? What do you mean? He could stay in Camden, of course. He can continue going to school. Education here is free to anyone who wants it. Um... Well, shouldn't an adult look after him? Yes, I was going to bring that up during the next council meeting. If Jesse was open to it, I was going to suggest that one of our members takes him under their wing. Um. well, I mean, why don't you adopt him? Me? I've never had any children. I wouldn't know the first thing to do with him. Though I suppose I was friends with his father. And I could teach him a lot. I'll bring it up at the next council meeting and see what everyone thinks. There you go. That was a good suggestion. Thank you. Oh, I'm full of good ideas, love. I just don't let them out very often. Um, well, why didn't his dad like the pistols? <laughs> it was no secret that Mr. Gray wasn't a big fan of us. Or so he said, at least. But he never left Camden, did he? I always liked Mr. Gray. And truth be told, I could understand some of the points he made. Yeah, no well. flames the pistols have got everything figured out. We're trying our best, though. I think that matters. The truth is, things went to shit long before the bombs fell. Mm. We have a chance now to do it different. We can rebuild the world better than it was. More just. More equal. Not the whole world, obviously, but our little world. Here in Camden. Well, that's it. Cheers. And there you have it, puppy dog. There you have it. Oh, goodness, what's she given me? Water, hasn't she? One of the weightiest things ever. All right, well, do you know what? 
could do with a little snacky poos anyway, so. Hmm. Well. Could eat the pasty. Doesn't weigh very much, though. Um. Hmm. Let's. Let us see. Really? Applesauce? Who knew that applesauce was so heavy? Uh, do you know what? Let's eat the pumpkins. They're probably quite weighty. Um, Radstag meat. Sardines. Oh, lots of rads, though. Hmm. Vegetable soup. Apple pie. That'll do. All right, Churchill, come on. Let's um, return to Palmyra and tell her that all is good, all is well, and that she can continue growing whatever it is that she's growing. Ah, oh, just as the sun is rising, Churchill. What the hell? What's going on? Bloody mitten lurk. Get out! What are you doing? Weirdo? What a weirdo! Get away! Churchill? Go for it! Alright. Well, we killed it. Dude? Are you alright, mate? What the hell? Oh, these bloody gatherers. What is their deal? Look, there's more of it. What the hell? Did you do this, dude? I mean, if you did, fair play. Fair play. Okay. Who are you? Are you a friendly robot? Or are you a bad robot? Sirentron. Are you like a weird version of Siren Head? Or something? I don't know. Weird. Okay, is there anything else here? Ooh, hey! Ooh. Let's have a look. Is Siren Trong not going to be happy because we've opened up this chest? Is he like Siren Head? Uh. <sighs> I mean, what? Combat shot, shotgun. Um. Let's have a look. Still not as good as ma- Oh no, it is. It's no, it isn't. Massively bad. You know, not so. Well, never mind. Don't mind me, sir. Don't mean to cause any kind of offence. Well. What's this place? Oh god. Um. There's that radio noise again. Where the hell is it coming from? Is it you? Okay, it's you. It's you! Okay. Alright. Jesus. Okay. Okay. Alright. Um, dude, can you... Yeah, thank you. Thank you, um, sir. Is it th is this radio noise still here? No, it is. So it's not them. Is it something in the building? Something? I don't. I don't get it, Churchill. Where the hell is this is coming from? Well, never mind. I suppose. All right. Are you all right, puppy? Oof. All right. Excuse me. Thank you. Palmyra. Hello. Did you talk to Polly? Yes, I did. Yes, she is going to stop throttling the hydroponic water supply. Oh, thank Walden. No, thank me. And thank you. There you go. I don't know what you did, but you just saved us from disaster. Camden hasn't been without food in over a hundred years. My ancestors made sure of that. Well, that's good. I couldn't let the hydroponics fail on my watch. Please accept this gift. 
And know that you have my full and unconditional sponsorship. Brilliant. If there's anything else I can do for you, please don't hesitate to ask. Now, will you only buy food? Hmm. Well, your ancestors set up this hydroponics lab, this particular yes. one. They ended up in London after the bombs and found refuge in Camden. Hmm. Others weren't as friendly. But luckily, the pistols welcomed them with open arms. Oh, good. And it was lucky for the pistols, too. You see, the pistols didn't know this at the time, but my ancestors brought with them agricultural knowledge. Books written in the ancient text described how to farm using hydroponics. None of us can read that language today, but my grandfather could. He taught me everything I know. Yeah, uh, it seems like you really rely on polyester to keep this place running. We all rely on each other. Camden's a machine. Mm, true. If one part breaks, the whole thing breaks. That's why cooperation is important to us. <sighs> Does it bother you that she wasn't cooperating before? I admit I was frustrated earlier, but I'm sure Polly had her reasons. She did, incidentally. I'm going to speak to her about it at the next council meeting. But I hold no ill will towards her. That's good. Um, do you like working in hydroponics? I love it. It's my life's work. It makes me feel closer to the ones who came before, you know. Hmm, okay. Well, um... Go ahead. I guess I, uh, I should be It'll going. It'll be good to have you with us. Well, alright. Pistols endorsement. Look at that. Do you all have a, have a, have a store in here? person who I could... Ah, maybe behind the bar. Will you buy items from me? I'm, I'm rather... Rather encumbered. Hmm. Thank you very All much, right. sir. Absolute skin fall last night. I'm sure that you did. System gin. It's tastier than you imagine, but that taste is a trap. Hmm, I'm sure. Well, right, Churchill. We have apparently learnt something, so let's have a little look here. Hmm... Now then, now then, we could potentially upgrade our insurance a little. That might be worth it. Hmm. Yes, I think we'll go with that. Robotics expert for one. See if we can stop those pesky robots from um, causing such a trouble to us. Um, and I think potentially... Hmm. Maybe endurance that might might be worth it. Yes, I think so. Definitely. All right. So now we have to go and see the other fella. Churchill? Oh, there you are, puppy. Come on. We've got to go and see Mr. Oh, Captain, what was his name? Captain Wonderful or something? Captain something or other? Captain Reasonable. Now, where is Captain Reasonable? Um, hmm, where is he? Oh, get the herbs. Ah, uh, he's at Camden Town Underground Station. Well, we can go there. Come on, Churchill, let's go. I wonder how reasonable Captain Reasonable is. Hmm. Do you suppose, Churchill, he will be lenient with us and just say all you have to do to get my endorsement is to make me a nice cup of tea I'm guessing that will probably not be the bloody case will it never is never is that simple never that easy what in the world is going on here some kind of gym or something um let's just check we're going the right way so ah yes so we just need to turn Right at the next right, and we'll be there. Brilliant. Hmm. Well, he might be perfectly reasonable. He might be a very nice man. Amel Emilio's Cafe House is. Uh, always the way. Always the way. Oh, yes, I remember the toy shop. Ah, yes, yes, yes. How reasonable is Captain Reasonable? Does anybody know? Um, 
Richard. Please remain calm if you are injured. All right. Don't just... Not even going to ask it. So is he actually inside the... The underground station? Danger. Off license. What? Hooligan commu commune. My hounds learned to swim today. Did so they? So proud of them. Or is he inside here? No. He must be. Oh my god. Hello. Harry. Please remain calm if you are injured. Uh, I'm, I'm not injured. I'm attempting to find Captain Reasonable. Is he in? No. Can't get in there. All right. Bloody hell. Oh. Here you are. Ooh, ooh, is this like some kind of bar? Not now. Can it's I? It's too early, and I'm too hungover to talk about theory with you. Luckily, I didn't want to talk about theory with you, did I? You miserable old trout. What's going on? Some kind of commotion. All right, Captain Reasonable. Let's see how reasonable you actually are. Hello. Nice to meet you. Oh, okay. Raymond, although most around here call me Captain Reasonable. All right, Captain Reasonable. Um, <sighs> Apache Alice asks. Well, she sent me to you to see if you need any help with anything. But I'm Ava. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. I'm. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Uh, classic British politeness loop there. It's all right. Um, yeah, Apache Alice sent me. It's actually pretty simple. There's a cache of guns in a police station in Lewisham. Okay. Need you to hop over there and fetch them for me. Sound doable. Or even throw in a monkey to make it worth your while. A monkey? Game. I'll even sign you an endorsement. I... I, I don't really want a monkey. Um, I do have some questions. Far away, if you'll excuse the pun. Yes, of course. Um, is the police station occupied? Dare I ask this question? Unfortunately, it is. Yep. Uh, nobody's serious. Some rabble. Should be a doddle for someone of your talents. Really? And how did the guns get to a police station on the other side of town, dare I ask? The station wasn't occupied, originally. Oh. We used to use it for drop-offs. Relatively defensible, easy to rig with traps, not to cover. Traps, great. The last drop didn't go well. Long story short, the guns are in pristine condition, but locked in the chief's office. And whose guns are they, pray That's tell? the tragedy of it. They're ours. In fact, we've already paid for them several times, at considerable expense, I might add. Who have you paid? What do you mean? I uh, don't like to be rude about people, but the previous council leader, Malcolm Rhodes was a reprehensible scumbag. Oh. Um. He must have been a right piece of work for you to feel like that. Oh, he was. Malcolm was playing a little game, you see. He told the council he needed a discretionary budget for sundry expenses. Oh. Off the record, he'd tell us it was to sidestep the gentry blockade. He was insistent we use non-local arms dealers, which... Honestly, sounded reasonable, given the gentry's supply cap. The problem was, every time we bought a shipment from the black market, they'd fail in the field. Oh. As you can imagine, a lot of fights about failure to inspect the weapons. It got pretty hairy. A few scars in the group from that period. But there was Malcolm in the middle, breaking it up, playing peacemaker. I even thanked him. Ooh. What would we do without you, the slippery fucker? Oh dear. If you told me, I'd never have believed you. I had to see it with my own eyes. The snake was playing free card Monty. Turns out, he was getting Mark Gormley, our former chief of security, to sneak them out of the armory, selling them to whoever wanted them. Not only was he embezzling money from the locals, he was actively arming our rivals to enrich himself. What the what? Can you imagine? Paying to be murdered by your own government. Uh, uh, I... Well... What's... Oh... Um, sorry, can we continue this conversation? How can I help you? 
Sound doable? Uh, yes. Or even throw in a monkey to make it worth your while. Where is what Same. is the monkey? I'll even sign you an endorsement. Guns, police station, Lewisham, got it. Legend. Yeah. I can taste the first pint on my lips already. I The thing is I, I I've got a dog. I don't really want a monkey as well. You keep the monkey. Come on, Churchill. I'll be glad when we can bloody get out of here. 